Yesterday I was listening to an international news channel talking about the law and order in the United States of America, most developed country in the world, talking about the breakdown of the law and order and reconstituting something to ensure the law and order prevails in the streets of the United States of America. When you think of the law and order, sometimes there is a major challenge for many countries maintaining the law and order. And, and sometimes we wonder whether every citizen of the, each of the countries understand what is the proper law and order that they need to follow. This has to be revalidated continuously. But I was thinking about a recent talk about the Benjamin Netanyahu, the Prime Minister of Israel, when he was talking about his own nation at a recently recent forum and he was talking about the achievements of the Israel, nation of Israel as the most advanced country in the technology, economically and many frontiers. But he was telling almost 3000 years ago they were a nation of slaves in Egypt for 400 years and when children also born into slavery for generations and generations and in fact Israel was the most uncivilized nation at that time most uneducated uncivilized most illiterate nation that was on the planet earth at that time as slaves in Egypt but today they have become one of the most dynamic nations with discipline, the most disciplined army, one of the most disciplined law and order. Already two or three prime ministers have gone into prison or two or three presidents have already gone into prison irrespective of the position the law applies to. And even the current prime minister Benjamin Netanyahu under investigation independently by the police and the courts. What is lacking sometimes is individually for us to look at the order of our lives. Forget about the law for a moment. Look at the order. Look at the order in the universe. Such an awesome order in the universe. And that kind of order we need to bring to our personal lives, our individual lives. There's so much of disorder in our lives chaotic status in our lives and this is the time that we need to really think about our lives and bring that order as the universe display a glorious order and there are certain universal laws which we cannot break in fact the law of gravity and it's, man, or it's not the man-made laws but the universal laws are very dangerous if you break it ladies and gentlemen we need to bring some order to our lives to surge ahead so that we can really bring discipline to ourselves and thereby bring discipline to our society.